<laughs> my um, my mom is Mexican. I was born in Mexico City, and my grandmother on my mom's side was very, very close to me. And she told me something, not once, but she would repeat it, not all the time. She wasn't annoying about it, but it was a memorable thing that it's stuck with me. So much so that I was explaining it to my six-year-old daughter, which is that uh, she would tell me, Paul, you know what's in heaven is work. And so I told that to my daughter, and she was like, oh, I, uh, and then, but we were like drawing together, and I was said, you know, Eva, it's like right now, we're working, like you love doing projects. And she said, oh, oh, I get it, so work should be fun. And it's like from my grandmother down to my daughter. Uh, I think that the point is that uh, it goes together with um, Business Insider had a great post about startups and should you sell for 20 million or 200 million and what's better for the founder. And they interviewed a bunch of people and Jonah Peretti gave, I think, the best answer, which is if you're in it for the money, it's the, you're in it for the wrong reason. So I think, uh, I think finding stuff that really you can pass the time away, you get lost in it, you don't realize in four hours past, uh, you know you're onto something. And, uh, and, and so finding something that's a reflection of your personality that builds off of everything you've all learned already I think is that the magic thing, like when you try to find something totally new and I'm going to start from scratch, I think you're not on the right path. It's when you take, you know, all the weird things that are, that have made you, you, and you assemble that into the thing you do, that that's where I see people uh, get really successful.